Hello everyone, today we are going to discuss how to create CK editor in React. I have uh, uh, already completed the basic template of uh, uh, React app. I have created uh, in this uh, editor component in the components folder and already written app.js, uh, used routes uh, and uh, put the editor at uh, route slash. I will not show you how all this is done because I am considering that you have the basic knowledge of how react works and I have used a function based component I will also show how class based component is used in CK editor react I have also started the react server npm when start and everything is uh, running up and good so let's get started here in the app.js we have routes uh, which we have re used by react router dom React Router DOM version which I have used is 5.3, right? Because in the latest version we have to wrap all this in the routes and which is too much of a hassle for me. So I am not using the latest version but the previous one. So let's start creating the editor component in which we will put our secret editor. So before moving further, uh, I would like to show you something. Uh, it's my website called note yard for those uh, who are not willing to watch the video to the end and directly want the code here i have put the code in a uh, create seek editor in react blog uh, here i have written properly how this video will proceed and how uh, all the code is written uh, you can directly copy and paste from here i will provide the website and this blog link in the description so step one to create this editor is to, to go on google and search online ck editor builder it's it's the service provided by the ck editor to download its files and directly implement them into your project when you open this uh, builder then you will see that in step one you can see many type of editor we will choose classic one here different types of editors are shown like classic inline balloon so if you like want to implement an editor like medium website if you have visited uh, medium.com then you will see that they have implemented balloon type editor so you can choose balloon on next step you will see all the plugins uh, you can choose plugins of your choice I have already chosen the default ones in the next step you will have to choose the plugins which are available for your account like if you have premium account then you can choose all the premium plugins also but here the default ones which i have chosen are all available so it's good to go in the next step choose your language in the next step you click start here and their building is started as you can see download the zip file of this editor will be downloaded now take this zip file cut from the download folders and go to your project here in your project you have to paste this into the root folder root folder I mean is that the folder in which your node modules are present or your source folder is present here as you can see if you extract this uh, folder then this will be in this format and your project is in this format so you have to put this uh, extracted folder that zip file and then extract it into that folder as uh, shown below here in the node modules in the root folder you have to put, put this ck editor 5 zip or ck editor 5 extracted zip folder here in the text details which is my root folder I will put this here uh, let me rename this to ck editor 5 which is more convenient ck editor 5 extract this folder ck editor 5 here extract so let me see yes it's good so, now if i open this folder you can see build sample source in source which have main file and in build we have this project build like npm run build which we do in our project here we have all, are already given this build in sample you will see a html file which we you can run and test how it's looking 
Now to install this CK Editor 5 folder or this build into our project, we need to run a command called npm add file CK Editor 5, which is the uh, CK Editor 5 is the folder name as shown here. So run this command, then this CK Editor 5 build will be added into our pack package.json. Wait for it. Wait for it. Mm, yes, now the command has been completed. Let's move on to the blog which I was showing you first. Here in this blog, as you can see, I have written the code for class space component how Cigator is implemented in the class or in function based component also. So I will copy this uh, code from here and directly paste this code into in the uh, component editor component. I will show you how this code uh, is working. Just be with me for a second. Change the my editor name to editor and also export default editor. Now let's move to code. In editor custom build, build master editor in the second line. If you click on that, you will visit on the editor build which we extracted in our main folder from the zip file which we downloaded from the CK editor builder now I have imported it here as the editor and classic editor and uh, uh, install have I installed or not I think I haven't so let's install npm install CK editor 5 react uh, this is the node module package for CK editor 5 in react so let it install wait 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 okay it had been installed successfully right and compiled successfully also so no error no error is showing up so let's explain this code a simple heading in the class name app and after that ck editor which i imported from the ck editor 5 react then uh, attribute editor equals to classic editor editor is the attribute in which you want to pass which editor we are implementing in in this we are implementing our custom editor classic editor and data default data which will show up in the editor on ready uh, on ready will be a uh, when the re uh, editor is ready to work right in on change when something is changed in the editor this function will run on blur if you focus out of the or click out of the editor then that and on focus when you click in the editor to type something then these function will work okay so let's run this code and see if this actually working or not uh, I think the code is not working because the editor hasn't shown uh, the error is cannot read property of undefined reading create not this again uh, this is the typical error which i also faced uh, recently when i implemented it again so let me get back to you in a moment a few moments later a few minutes later three days later so the error was that i imported it as editor as ck editor but uh, i had to do is simply import as an editor what i had done previously was i had written editor as ck ad as classic editor sorry as classic editor this was the import at first but uh, now i commented it out and uh, editor commented out and what i have done is uh, the import in the second line import editor from directly uh, no as or uh, something like this may be because the ck editor doesn't support uh, a function based component that well it is for class based component right so uh, one import may work for you one may not if one doesn't work then use that commented out one uh, here uh, class based component I have written let me copy this and show you class based components also if I paste it and save it it will not, not show any error in class based components so here export default my C editor my compile successfully as you can see it's working properly and if I control plus Z control plus Z and return back to the uh, function based component and let's show you that function based component is also working properly comment it out save 
refresh as you can see this is also working properly so uh, ck it does support uh, class based component but not function based component that well so you can use any of the import from here okay if uh, second one works for you then well and good if doesn't then third one will work for you because in my website in note yard uh, where i have implemented the ck editor let me show you uh here uh, as you can see in this ck editor i have used the third import this one ck editor as class editor it's working there but i don't know why it's not working here so second work is working here directly import editor if it doesn't work then use the uh, third line import okay now when you implement this code or some third error occurs then comment me in the section i will definitely help you and like this video if you liked it or subscribe my channel for more videos like this and i will see you next time bye